What's up guys, Duckman Gaming here, and we are back in the south, the same exact spot we left off with uh, Miss Erica here with her epic, epic armor. No, it's not armor, it's like just, I don't even know what it is, but I just know it's sexy and I don't, don't mind her having this, because it looks really good. So I do like the brother her armor, it's really awesome, but I like when my character shows his skin more. So we're going to use it for a while, and um, we could fast travel back to White Run. And because we completed the mission in the last video, but I don't want to, I don't want to go over there yet. What is that? <gasps> Shit, not wanting to fight Kitty. Shit. Come on, stay glitch. I feel like you like hear me shaking in my boots right now, but... And I just can't stress how this attack could really take me out. Uh, I'm a little bit scared. I got him. Man, I did not want to fight a cat. That was not the, uh... That was not the plan. Shows you how random this game is. But no, I'm trying to... Find... I know it's over here. There's a part where the black dragon brings another dragon back to life, and it's like way over here. I know it's by that that pointy there he is. I just saw him over there. He's over there. And I want to at least get to that part and fight that other dragon and hopefully win. I don't have much potion left, but I do have Erica with me somewhere. So hopefully we can do that, and then we'll go we'll go complete the mission. Actually, I think we'll go back to the Greybeards and complete that mission, then we'll complete the other mission. And they're both complete, I just gotta like, turn in the, uh... Be careful and jump off rocks, you guys all tips and tricks. <laughs> I just gotta return the stuff to them both. Man, man, I got see him way over there? That's where we're going, where that dragon is. Man, that Sega, that tiger, Sega 2 tiger would've killed me. He got, like, glitched, like, burn him for a minute, as you saw. If he didn't get glitched, he probably would have took me out. That was really sketchy. Like I said, if you see like landmarks that you can go to, go to them and just add them to the map so you can easily get back and forth and travel, fast travel to places. Now we're going to get here and it's going to be like, unlock. And now we can fast travel back here if we need to. Okay, see that dragon over there? That's where we're going. So we're going to wait here. I'm going to save. I'm going to get my stamina back up. Eric is going to show up again. Say hi. I mean Lydia. I get the names mixed up, Erica and Lydia. Actually, I thought it through a little bit. If I would have thought about it, I would have named my girl Elizabeth after the uh, old, the old princess back in the olden days who used to kill people, who killed like a shitload of people and bathed in their blood. Elizabeth, that Elizabeth, yeah, her. I would have named her after her because you know she kind of reminds me of her a little bit. And she kills a lot of people, but she's a queen. She's sexy as hell. So I just thought it'd be cool, but. Yeah, well, Erica works too. I like Erica. But as you see, there's that dragon again. If you saw him like two videos ago, we saw the first time of him uh, bringing other dragons back to life, and he's doing it again. So, we're gonna keep following in his footsteps and taking down the dragons that he brings back to life. So, hopefully, we eventually kill him. And, um, when we get that far, which would be in probably 30 more videos from now, when we get that far, I don't think I'm actually gonna record the end of the game for you guys and i say that because i've already recorded it i'll probably just post it and be like watch this you know what i mean but i don't know we'll see it depends after all that i might just post it just because it's part of the let's play and i've done so much work but we'll see what happens as you see this is a uh, dragon with the grave if you go up to it you'll get hit by his shout and they'll like make you a flying but as you see he's bringing them back to life and it did hit, ooh, ooh, damn, penny shot, penny shot, no, uh, I recommend as soon as this motherfucker comes up to attack him, as soon as he comes out the grave, bones and all, attack this motherfucker, and say peace, the big black dragon isn't gonna attack you, but like, this motherfucker, we need to, we need to get him down as quick as possible, so while he's like, you know, regaining himself, go ahead and do work on him, you know what I mean? And so we already got a good piece of his ass pulling up. And you see the black dragon back there is leaving. So he leaves and just me and this guy now. 
and Erica's pretty much distracting him. So now Erica's distracting him. He shouldn't be, he shouldn't be as hard as the other dragon was. So he should be able to get him, hopefully. But I don't know, I say that now and he takes us, but... <laughs> I think there's, there's some more guys, there's some more guys also shooting him too. That's who he's fighting right now, there's some guys over there. So me and Erica will shoot at him from here. And he'll attack those guys, everyone but me, and we'll just take his ass out. It's like five versus one right now. I'm sure we can all take this back. Too. It's not moving so much. I don't like fire my area. Damn! Don't like go way the fuck over there. It doesn't even matter. Let him go fight a damn something else. So kill him, you know. Like if something else kills him. All you have to do is run up to him and burn him with fire or just hit him one time and you can still absorb his soul. Like, you just have to hit him, so it doesn't matter who kills him, to be honest. I do want the experience points, though, to be honest. Bastard, I'm like, he is fighting, he is fighting him, but he is... I said that three times. Oh, look at that, glitch! Nice. He is fighting a giant, though. That giant that giant's gonna whip his ass. That may have been Oh shit, giant after me, okay. Shit just got serious. We need to go. That dragon will kill me one hit. Not dragon, but that giant. Run up here. Take a shit. Get the fuck out of here. Alright, dragon, you stay where the fuck over there. Let me just absorb this soul. No. I want this soul. Ooh. So that dragon will fuck me. Or not dragon, but that giant will destroy me. Like he will one punch me and I will go fly. I am quite literally getting chased by a dragon. By a giant. Sorry, I'm getting the names mixed up, but I'm a little in panic mode right now. This is the random shit that can happen. I go from fighting a dragon that decided not to fight me and get his ass whipped by a giant that killed him. I stole the bones and absorbed the soul of the dragon, and now I'm getting chased by the giant. Skeleton right there. It's always skeleton. I have my own issues to deal with right now. God, this has been probably the most exciting first few minutes. Oh, I can wait now. Hooray. That was probably the most exciting first few minutes in this whole entire Let's Play. We survived it, though. Hell yeah. Fuck that giant. Let's go ahead and just warp our happy ass back over here to the Greybeard to give him a thing. Wow, dude. That was... I'm sorry I kind of lost my uh, composure and lost my speech there, but that was crazy. Holy shit. That was definitely the easiest dragon. I hit him like maybe six times total. And then, uh, it still says giant. You see that up at the menu? They need to fix that. But I hit him like maybe six times total. And the people shot him. And the giant finished them all. Then he wanted a piece of me. I was like, nope, taking these bones, taking the soul, bucking. I'm really surprised it didn't get to me though. Those giants are fast. He seriously, one hit would have probably made me go blind. Seriously. I came here for something. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to put it on the menu here. Do you forget? No, it's not you. You're not the one. You are no superhero. You? Nope. This guy over here. You. Hey. Ah, you retrieve the horn. Yes, yeah, here's the horn. Well done. Thank you. You have now passed all the trials. I know I have. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. All right, it's time for you to recognize me as Dragonborn. We finally picked back up on this mission like two videos later. <laughs> He's just gonna like initiate me as a Dragonborn. It'll be the end, and we'll go back to White Run and finish that mission. The final word of unrelenting force. Da. Which means push. So he also gives me the last word for my push, so I can really see people flying now. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. 
Yeah, now I can like knock, uh, I can knock giants back now. They like my new sexy outfit. He's gonna raid me again with his dragon shout. Isn't, it, isn't this game so much better now that I have this outfit? Like, I love my character so much more now. It's so good. Look at that ass. Oh, sorry. We would speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. You can withstand. You probably should stand here. They're gonna yell at me. My girl's so short. <laughs> Look, uh, Erica, or not Erica, but uh, the fuck's her name again? Lydia. Lydia has to take the shots with me. She's not Dragonborn, she killed her though. No, oh, she's not taking them. That was funny. She is though, kinda. Damn, she's good in that outfit. We're keeping this outfit for a while, yeah. Until we get like a better version of it. I'm sorry, but I'd much rather see her sexy ass than have her in a good outfit. Stop yelling at me. That it, we're done. Sky above, voice within. Sky above, voice within. And that's that. So now you can you can go back here and you can get more shouts from these guys, which is really cool. You know we might do that later on, but now we're going to return to the White Run. Then we are going to finish that mission going out which we did last last time. I'm looking around here because I know they have some shit that I want to steal. And my girl is not only a sexy little murdering bitch, she's also a thief, so don't let her know I said that though, please. She's pretty badass, she'll slit my throat. Steal every day. <laughs> These potions are worth a lot. I mean, I'm not going to use them. I'm going to sell them. They're worth 300 each. It makes them probably about worth 100. Probably about 300. All three of them. Like I said, I read these books because usually books will give you some sort of power up. I don't know. They're supposed to. Anyway, enough stealing potions. Let's get the hell out of here and return to White Run. I really wish you could fast travel when you're inside a building instead of having to go outside. I mean, you might as well. Why not? How exciting in this episode. We got to fight a dragon, got chased by a giant, learned the final shout for our, for our Force Unleashed power, finished that mission, got screamed at by some old guys, <laughs> um, stole some potions, and finishing up this mission for the companion. Nice. We're climbing 13 minutes, so we're doing pretty awesome. This will probably be the last one I record tonight. So the last four parts I've been recording all in one sitting. And it's like about to be 7 a.m., so I need to kind of render these and go to bed. So. <laughs> I don't think I'll be renting them all tonight because they're like seriously two hours worth of playing. So if you guys are enjoying this, I will say though, um, each video is getting almost around 100 plays. And normally when I do Let's Plays like Modern Warfare and Battlefield, they only get like 30. So it's doing a lot better. I mean, I, I want it to always do better and better and better. Hopefully it doesn't die down, but we're doing good. Sabor says that I have the strength of Shut up, idiot. Some people don't think I'm I take smart, care of the problem. another job well done. Your payment is secure, and you have my thanks. 100 gold. Appreciate that. I'm looking for work. Skior was looking for you Of course earlier. he is. Mm. Skor. I actually start to know these guys by name, so I do this shit so many times. You know what I'm doing? See this lady, she has to clean up all the messes I make, so I like doing this. See that huge mess I just made? She has to clean it up. <laughs> I'm such an asshole. So 
So I mean, I get the idea of school is looking for me, but where is he? Is it late? Yeah, it's like 2 o'clock in the morning. He's obviously sleeping, so we're going to wake his ass up. I was going to wait, but no. We're going to wake him up. <laughs> I don't remember what mission this is. Like, it's kind of weird. The companions, they're like, uh... They'll make you do really stupid stuff, like go to someone's house and just kill like a wolf that in her house, and then you'll come back and do like the main mission for him. So I mean, it's cool. When I, you know, I like it. That's not him. That's not him either. That's a girl. And that's another girl. Guess she's over in this one. This guy's like, I'm going to bed. I'm gonna wait for you all night. There he is. Wake up. There you are. I'm looking for work. Yes, and we have something special for you this time. What do you mean? Last week, a scholar came to us. He said he knew where we could find another fragment of Wuthrak. He seemed a fool to me. If he's right, the honor of the companions demands that we seek it out. I'd be honored to retrieve it. There's a fine line between respect and bootlicking. But I like your spirit. We've decided this will be your trial. Do well, you'll be counted among the companions. Farkas will be your shield sibling on this venture, Well, He'll answer any questions you have. Try not to disappoint. Or to get him killed. Lydia, this means... I've got your back. You're at the part ways. I will get you after... After this mission. We'll come back and get you, okay? I'll head back home if you need me. Alright, baby. I'm gonna kiss goodbye. Come on, you know I look so sexy, but I want you to kiss me goodbye. It's okay, it's my wife to be right there. I'm gonna close this door and make a sweet whoopee with her. I'm actually just gonna spill some shit. She's asleep, she can't see me. She wakes up, what are you doing? Nothing. <laughs> Alright, that's about all I want to steal from you. What's up there? What are those potions? Jugs, they're nothing. <laughs> I was like, is that potions? Hey, he went back to see Jimmy. What a bitch. Anything here I can steal? Steal while you can. Here, I'll show you where another one of these little secret things are. Gotta be quiet in here. Be careful. I'm detected. Close that door. Here's one of these little things here. You gotta collect like 25 of them, so you might as well start collecting them now. How am I ever going to steal this Draco heart of you over here? You don't think I don't need it. Anyway, let's go talk to the, uh, the guy, Skull, or whatever his fucking name is. I'm going to start this mission. This mission is actually really cool, because me and him make a great team. I'll just burn him, and he'll attack him. And uh, it's a great team. Wake up. We're going on a mission. I hope you've read it yourself. you read it yourself. You sleep. So I'm told. Let's see if you impress. Alright, let's go. Mm -hmm. It's like I said, I'm going to use this fire. He's going to be using that. He's going to be staring at my hot girl this whole time. And you know his dumb ass wants to tap it. You know he wants to tap that ass. Oh yeah, that old lady. She has to be all up. I love making the mess. Look at that. Because when she comes in here and she goes, Oh my god. There she is. You have to clean this up. To the warriors up your you have to clean this up. To <laughs> I almost killed her one day. I did a mark of death by accident and like touched her, and it almost killed her. Like it, with mark of death, when you have it high enough, it drains your life. And if I didn't leave, like I had to like leave outside so it didn't kill her, she would die. She's a very weak lady. Very pathetic. Look at this mess I made. It'll be clean by the time I get back, probably. <laughs> It usually takes a couple days to clean it. It's just funny, she has to clean it all up. I'm such a bastard. <laughs> oh, we're approaching 20 minutes. We're at the end of this video soon. Um, since we are getting to 20 minutes, I do think that we are going to kind of not go ahead and do that mission. I mean, we're going to do it in the next video, but... I don't like it's gonna take another 20 minutes to actually do that mission. So let me look here. I'm 
Can't they have much I want to actually sell? I was going to say I'll well, go sell some stuff. I don't even have anything to sell. <laughs> I guess we're just going to call it a video, though. I've been looking for you. Got Let's see. A letter. Looks like that's it. Look at this guy. This guy comes up here and sends me a letter, and he's wearing nothing but underwear. And a cap and shoes. All right, what does this letter say? Um, I'm sorry I read that in my head, not out loud. <laughs> you guys, I'm sure you could read that in all of it. But I don't know, it said, I don't even really know what it said, I kind of glanced over something about my powers need to be used for some shit. <laughs> but anyway guys, like I said, we're probably going to call this a video. Um, if I got you guys a little pumped up to do this mission, my bad, but I didn't notice we're over 20 minutes. We did a lot in here, we like killed a dragon, we finished some quests. This is kind of like one of those in-between videos. You've been seen in the company of the companions. That's an honorable path to run through. But yeah, I think we're pretty much just going to end it here. So um, thank you guys for watching. And this is a good place to kind of save. Let's go ahead and look at where we're supposed to go from here. Get an idea. Alright, so we're supposed to go here. Into this cave. And that's where we're going to fight. So we're going to warp here. And then the next part, we're going to go to that cave. And we're going to whip some ass. Me and this retarded fella. <laughs> Now he's a good guy. I really like this guy. He becomes your friend after a while. And look at that freaking Drake, Draco hammer. I think it's badass. I've not made one of those yet, but I've made pretty much every other piece of material out of that set. But anyway, guys, it's 22 minutes long. I don't want to make this any longer. So we're going to call that a go. And look at my pretty sexy girl. She is so attractive. And I'm going to save and go to bed. So thank you guys for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you haven't already. Uh, leave a comment and uh, please, more than anything, just watch. You know, watch this, reach, read it to your friends and all that great stuff. Add us on Facebook. You can look us up, Ducks and Gaming, in the search bar on your Facebook. That'd be really awesome. That's pretty much it. So, Erica says goodbye. I say goodbye and uh, we'll record some more parts later. So, peace. Holla. <laughs>